All right, there's a notion of a random variable and the notion of expectation. Given a finite probability space, a random variable is a function, just a function, which assigns to each element in the sample space a real number f of x. That number can be positive, neg negative, or zero. There's just no restriction on it whatsoever. And then the expected value of this random variable, denoted e of f, is the quantity f of x1 plus f of x2 plus f of x3, et cetera, et cetera. Okay. And actually, there's some notation that's missing right here. Let me uh, get off the... I see this slide is not printed correctly. The, the expectation of the random variable f is f of x1 times the probability of x1 plus f of x2 times the probability of 2 plus dot, 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 out to f of x in. Don't forget the probabilities. In other words, the probability of x1, the probability of x2, et cetera, probability of x in. The slide doesn't have those probabilities and, and, and is in error for that reason. I'll fix it before I post it. Okay, now let's go back to it with that correction in mind. But look at the example, and it should be clear. Let f assign the quantity m squared when a single die is rolled, and the number of spots showing is m. What's the expectation of f? So I'm going to roll a die. I'm going to look at the number of spots, and I'm going to take that number and square it. So what's the expectation? So the probability that you get a 1 is 1 out of 6, and that gives you the value 1 squared. The probability that you get a 2 is 1 over 6, and that gives you the quantity 2 squared. 3 squared, 4 squared, 5 squared, 6 squared, but all of them multiplied by 1 sixth. And I've pulled the 1 sixth out front. And that's 91 over 6. And as a decimal, that's 15 point repeating threes. And now I make the caution, probabilists love to use symbols that look like sets, symbols like x, y, z, and w to denote random variables. They don't use functions. Even though a random variable is a function, they, you know, and, Engineers, computer scientists love symbols like F and G and H for functions. But probabilists use capital letters like X, Y, and Z. I could explain that to you, but I won't attempt to. So when you see an X, sometimes it will mean the sample space, but more likely it will mean a random variable. All right, let's take some examples. Suppose I have the opportunity to play the game associated with the example we just talked about. I pay $15 to play the game. And then what's the game? I roll a die, and I receive as payment the square of the number of dots. So if I roll a 1, I've paid $15, I get $1 back, I've lost $14. If I roll a 2, I get $4 back on my $15 payment, I've lost $11. If I roll a 3, I get 9, I've lost $6. If I roll a 4, I make a dollar, etc. So. Is it in my best interest to play this game? The expected value of my winnings each time I play is $15.33. I will never get $15.33 because my return is actually some dollars, whole dollars. 
but my expected return is $15.33 for a $15 investment. <laughs> Mentally, that means every time I play the game, I expect to have a net return of 33 cents. So do I want to play this game? You betcha. And I want to play it and 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 play it because the more I play it, I expect to make 33 cents per game. So if I play it long enough, I'll have all the money I ever need. But there's a big but. While you're playing this game, if you want to make big bucks, you have to be prepared for large deviations, meaning at some times you will be very, very, very much in the hole. So you've got to have a big bankroll to absorb these variations. And often on games like this, people think, oh, I, I just keep playing. I'll win, I'll win, I'll win, I'll win. But somewhere along the line, somebody says, you're, you're down a million bucks, and I want my million bucks right now. When you get it back, I'll give it back to you. But you can't come up with the million bucks. So don't, uh, moral is don't, don't, don't take some of these examples and say, I'm, I'm going to go get rich uh, doing this kind of thing, because you might rue the day.